Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is the Top League, and this is Call of Duty 4, the beginning of something new. The beginning of a new era, the era of first person shooter. Call of Duty 4 came with a lot of things attached to it. Customization, kill streaks, something that we have never experienced before. We've all been playing this World War II simulators. Medal of Honor was one of my favorite games of all time. But when Call of Duty 4 came along, we've all switched to Call of Duty. This feeling that you got for the first time controlling your soldier, killing the enemy, unlocking the golden camo, getting your kill streaks number that popped up on the screen telling everybody that you have a kill streak of 20 these days are long ago they're gone we need something new Call of Duty 4 was published in 2007 and we've, since then we've been playing the same game over and over Maybe MW2 came with a lot of renovation to it, a lot of flows, that's the tall of renovation, you have to try. They never faced, fixed things because of reason that we know, they're not gonna go into these things. Everything takes its time and leaves. By the end of this generation, in the introduction of a new one, the 8th generation, we're seeing the decline of Call of Duty. Most of the people that have been hardcore Call of Duty fans are just leaving the Call of Duty scene one after one after another. Scene enters, Hutch, Blame Tree. These guys who got us all involved into the Call of Duty scene are just trying new things. When I've seen Tidal Falls new trailer, I thought to myself, this is something that we've never experienced before. This is something new. I want to play something like this. I want to feel the noob inside me again. Being a professional or just a good at thing and consistent with it isn't always fun. Call of Duty has been the victim of its own success and they tried to work out the formula success over and over until people were just bored of the same thing. I don't think that even if Call of Duty Ghost Week was good, people would still be playing it. People are bored. Even myself, I've tried playing Battlefield even knowing that I won't love the game and I've never been into the Battlefield. But the reason I'm always playing MW2 is because there has been a lot of good things in the game. And still, it's simple. Remember Activision and Infinity Ward and all game developers. Being simple is one of the formulas of success. I'm sorry about the just noise in the background. But the air has gone. And the time has passed. Modern shooters are not fun anymore, even futuristic. Black Ops 2, for me, is the worst first person shooter I've ever played. And no wonder why I, always, I only have two days playing the dead crap. Maybe you agree with me, maybe not. But definitely, we need something that's new. Something that can shake Call of Duty of its own throne. You can notice there that there have been multiple of games that tried to push Call of Duty, but none of them have succeeded until Call of Duty came along and destroyed itself. Just like the very good player, the good athlete that tries that tries a lot, that thinks a lot in one situation that he couldn't even pull off one trick at a time. 
being sophisticated will just end up being a failure. Not all these things work along. And I think they need more than two years to make a good game. They made Call of Duty in four game in four years. And that's why we've seen this series rise to the top. I'm not saying that I stopped loving I stopped loving Call of Duty, but I think we need a change. A positive change. A positive change of attitude to the series. And something that maybe can make us all feel excited about and feel happy while playing. I think that you will tell me in the comment section what do you think of the commentary. Have a good day and goodbye. See you soon.